Did you know that the kiss of Judas was not a betrayal but a cosmic act of liberation, a truth that will prevail? According to the Gospel of Judas, a secret text unveiled, Judas understood Jesus' message, his mission never failed. He kissed Jesus not in deception, but in obedience and initiation, to reveal him to the authorities, a divine proclamation. The kiss set in motion a plan, a revelation so grand, to free the divine spark within Jesus from the material land. But there's more to this story, a symbolic meaning to explore, a Gnostic worldview, divine emanations galore. Judas came from Barbalo, the first emanation of the divine, the source of all spiritual beings, a truth so fine. Barbalo initiated creation with a kiss to the invisible spirit, birthed Yaldabaoth, the ruler of the material, we must admit. Yaldabaoth and his archons enslaved humanity in ignorance and sin, preventing them from accessing divine knowledge, a battle to begin. Judas from Barbello will complete what was started by kissing Jesus, the invisible spirit embodied, not departed. The kiss will reverse the effects of the first, restore harmony divine, allowing Jesus to escape Yaldabaoth's grasp, his original place to find. Judas, belonging to the same holy generation as Jesus, will follow him to the Pleroma, a destiny so wondrous. Praise for his role in this cosmic drama, exalted above all, Judas the hero answering Jesus' call. The Gospel of Judas sheds light on a misunderstood history. Judas, not a traitor, but a hero, a truth so contrary. The kiss of Judas, a sign of love and loyalty, not betrayal, a cosmic act of liberation, a truth we must unveil. This text reveals a deeper understanding, a complex view of Jesus, Judas, and humanity, a perspective so true. The Gospel of Judas deserves attention and respect from scholars and believers, its wisdom we must reflect.